You know when you first meet somebody and you first fall in love? And you could be standing in a subway station and nobody is around, like the whole world's spinning and you're just completely still. I felt like that every single day upon first meeting him. And this reminded me of that feeling. It's a very beautiful time. I booked their high jewelry campaign and then they asked if I would be open to doing a bridal shoot. Mr. Graff thought it would be really beautiful if my actual husband was a part of it. And so of course, you know, we jumped on that offer. It was the most magical thing we've ever had the honor of doing. To shoot with him, I swear it was just like we were at home. Just like we were just doing us. To have that in a shoot, like to be able to just be myself and not have to play a part or play a role or turn it up an extra notch just to feel exactly how I'm feeling was really refreshing. So I haven't had a shoot like that before. You know, we didn't really get to have a wedding. Um, so I woke up on my birthday. I said, I want to get married today. So I went to the courthouse. He did go get me a little bouquet for me to hold so I would feel like it was a real wedding. It was, it was really special. I mean, we were married, you know? I mean, it was, it was a very surreal moment, but it didn't really hit us until this, this shoot. This was, this was what, um, what we will look back and celebrate. This is the day. Oh, he's so cute. I love that picture. I was standing at the monitor when it was like his solo time. My cheeks hurt so bad from smiling so hard at him. During the fitting, after I explained to them that we never had like a real wedding, they're like, so he's never seen you in a wedding dress. And so during the fitting, they made him leave so that I could try on the wedding dresses and he wouldn't see it first. You know, it's bad luck to see the bride in her wedding dress. Come the day, they hid me behind this poly board and he was standing at the altar and uh, they played some music and I walked down the aisle. I mean, I was trembling, you know, like actually getting married. Like that's how you feel when you walk down the aisle. When we finally got together and our eyes met, we were both in tears, pink nosed, like the whole, whole nine yards. It really hit both of us that we, we were so in love. We're so in love, we're so lucky to be in love, to be in Sri Lanka, to be on this beautiful beach, holding each other, getting married for what feels like the first time and having it captured so beautifully. I mean, that was, that was definitely the highlight. Wow. We had so much fun that day. And we've talked about it literally every day since that it just, it really felt like there was no one there. I think buying that ring is a lot of pressure. I would say the advice is just to try to embody that person and don't put too much pressure on it because it's just a symbol of love. One really wonderful thing about Graf is that they have pieces that fit every type of, every type of bride. I had a full princess moment with like a full tiara and beautiful necklace, gorgeous rings, and the most beautiful dress that I think I've ever seen in my life. That was probably my favorite look. Um, but I also really loved the short dress. There was something so fun and spunky about like this new bride, you know, just being on the beach, simple fun, like no care in the world. Oh wow, that's a beautiful one. You see love, I mean, you see the authentic love. You see a story, you see connection. I wanna tell everybody exactly how I feel, like how love feels, like what it feels like to fall in love over and over again with the same person. And to be able to share that and capture that in such a authentic way to us was just magical. Absolutely magical. Thank you, Graf. I love it. <laughs> My little wedding oh. album.